Hello, this is Dr. J back with some more. Let's play Fire Emblem Engage. So we've got some of our uh, party members here enjoying the pool. Here we've got Vander reclining, and good lord, what a silver fox this guy is. <laughs> and over here, oh, it's Fram in a swimsuit. Hey, Fram. You know, I would if the game would let me. Alright, so before we move on to the next story chapter, I'm going to go in the arena, and I decided to show that on screen, because I figure of all the different things I do here on the Somnial, the arena fights have a higher likelihood of being interesting to watch. All right, so who is most lacking in levels? None of my promoted classes, really. Yunaka is at 16, which is quite high. Fram is at 18, which is crazy. Chloe's only at 14, which for the characters I use regularly is starting to become relatively low, actually. So I'm considering Chloe. Obviously, there's also Clan, but I'm not really hurting for spellcasters now. Poor clan is kind of falling behind. Hmm. Yeah, I think maybe I'll level up Chloe a bit. I am Chloe, Royal Knight of Virene. Will you face me? I never tire of those awesome Pegasus dodges. I always do my best. Now and in the matches to come. Good job, Chloe. Alright. So she's up to 15 now. Should I level up anybody else? Or should I just focus on her? I could give Amber another level or two. I could level up Vander. I think the poor guy could use it. Let's uh, train Vander a bit. I have been waiting for this. I won't go easy on you just because we're allies. Oh, Vander's. Oh boy. <laughs> Getting wrecked. I must continue to improve. Well, that was not a good matchup for Vander. He had type disadvantage and everything. Let's hope he has better luck with his next opponent. Will you face me? I am Diamant, Crown Prince of Brodia. Why does he face the same guy again? I must continue to improve. Is Vander one of those characters who's a promoted class but actually has terrible stats? <laughs> I'm starting to get that impression. And of course I'm going to uh, level up with my emblems. So let's level up uh, Yunaka and Lucina. Because I think that they're just at level 1, so... I am Lucina. Let's see what you can do. Let's see what you can do. Uh oh. Ooh. Wait, that crit only did three damage. Oh, her damage is. Lucina's damage against Yunaka was one. That's crazy. She stood no chance in that fight. Your sword looks an awful lot like Marth's, Lucina. Is it actually the same blade? Good eye. The guard and pommel have been replaced, but it's otherwise the same sword. Interesting. Alright, and then let's see if I can get both Yunaka and myself up to level 10. 
with our emblems. Yeah, we have enough bond fragments for this, so let's do it. You look tough. I'd better be careful. I'm Lucina. Spar with me. Still just one damage. <clears throat> I lost? Hey! I actually won! There was never any other possible outcome, really, Yunaka. I can't get over what a privilege it is just to lay eyes on a legendary weapon like Falchion. Would you believe me if I told you its name actually used to be Pointy Demon Spanker? Oh, is that Lucina cracking a joke? <laughs> She's ordinarily so straight-laced. And those types are usually really good at telling jokes because they can do so with a completely deadpan delivery. Oh, I was already at level 10 with Lynn. Well, I have enough to get to level 15 and why not? Let's have a good match. I'm Lynn. I won't be holding back. Back at you. I am the Divine Dragon. Victory is yours. But I won't lose next time. Somehow I won. That was a really cool fight to watch. Since Lynn does zero damage to me, there was no chance of me not winning, but it looked cool. I think Fire Emblem Engage has sort of reached a pinnacle in terms of how cool looking the, the battle scenes are. They're really good. Okay, so we didn't get a new uh, conversation, and I was kind of not paying attention to the abilities that I got from that, which I probably should have. What was that strong bond thing, for example? Deep Synergy. Ah, we get that at level 20. Unit's engage meter is shortened one step. Speed plus 5, wow, that's pretty huge. Here we go, Strong Bond. Unit stays engaged an additional turn. That's a pretty good benefit. Cool. Okay, I think we're done here. Time to move on to the next story chapter, I reckon. That is a lot of optional fights, but, uh, we spent two whole videos on that paralogue, so let's, um, let's just move on to the next story location for now, which is Oasis Village, I guess. That's funny, I thought we were at the palace. Oh, also, just to make sure that I don't have any <clears throat> any stray master seals I do not okay ring of the radiant hero that's probably Micaiah's uh, counterpart right well, whose name is just not coming to me. It's still not coming to me. Divine One, Royals of the Three Kingdoms, welcome to Solm Palace. I'm Sephoria, the Queen of Solm. It's an honor to meet you, Queen Sephoria. And you. Really, it's a treat. And a surprise. I never expected Fogato to bring the Divine Dragon here. 
Out of everything he's done on his outings, this is the most impressive. Folks seem really casual here in Solm. I was just doing what any prince would do for his queen. That's mom to you. My son tries to act so cool, so detached. Anyway, those introductions when you arrived, there were a lot of them. First you, Divine One, and then the Pyrenees, Brodian, and Illusian royalty. Quite the guest list. I was so overwhelmed, I nearly fell off my throne. You have my apologies. We're here about a very important matter. Yes, you said. Fell Dragon Sombron's return. I had no idea all that was happening. And he created those creatures, hmm? That explains why they're so vicious. But your palace hasn't been attacked by the corrupted? Or Illusion forces? Oh, it has. We got rid of them. I see. You got rid of them. Wait, really? All of them? You seem surprised. I'm impressed. But certainly glad no one's breached the palace. I mean, why would you be so surprised that they're capable of defending themselves? I'm sorry to hear the other countries are having a harder time of it. And Queen Lumera. I visited her in Lethos many times. She was always very gracious. Naturally, the Queendom of Solm stands with you in your war against the Fell Dragon. Thank you. On that note, I have a request. The Ring of the Radiant Hero, which was entrusted to Solm. May I take it? Of course. I'll get it right away. Wait. Hmm. Where was it again? Uh. <laughs> I haven't seen it for a while. Fogato, do you know where the ring might be? You know, I wouldn't have no been... No clue. Maybe it's in the doodad drawer? thought I had canceled auto advance. I thought maybe, for some reason, she would actually hesitate to give me the ring, maybe be the first person, but I wasn't anticipating that she would have just lost it. <laughs> hmm. Please, wait here a moment. Oh. Okay. The doodad drawer. Has it been lying around in a musty cupboard this whole time? This is one of the strongest emblem rings. I... I don't know what to say. Ah, you know what? I just remembered. Tamara took it with her. Tamara? My sister. Also the crown princess. She's set to inherit my crown. And like Fogato, she's always out doing who knows what. To be fair, I acted the same when I was young. Anyway, she's been gone for days. Probably on a camping trip. Oh, that sounds great right now. So it's true. The Crown Princess and Prince aren't around much. And she doesn't know when they'll be back. We can look for Princess Tamara. Do you have any idea where she might be? I think she was heading to the Southern Desert. In which case, she'd set up camp in the Oasis. All right, then. We'll head there. You know, a trip to the Oasis is just what I need. I'll pack my things. Actually, Mom, how about you stay put? Oh, all right. New kids go on without me. If you find Tamara, do summon the emblem, will you? I'd love to meet him. Be careful. It's already getting dark out. Come on, everyone. I'll lead the way. I would say this seems like a really... Oh, cutscene. Mm. This meat is gonna hit the spot. I hope you're Camera hungry angle. for fun, cause that's what's on the menu first. <clears throat> and now, an exclusive performance from the one and only Tamara. I'll be performing my favorite song with my backup singers, Marin and Panette. Ready. As am I. The game's tone has become a bit childish again, hasn't it? What, what kind of makeup is that? It looks horrible. Hope you remember the words. And a one, and a two. Meat, meat, meaty meat, meat. What, what, what am I watching? What have we here? A bunch of pretty birds squawking away in the night. Ha! Cheap, cheap. Cheap, cheap is right. But there's nothing cheap about the ring that one has. Let's grab it. 
Midi, Midi, ah uh, yeah. Midi, Midi. Uh, uh. Hey, hey, quit your con. Who are you two? Come on, wake up. What do you think? We're bandits. Bandits. And what do bandits do? Take stuff, like your fancy ring there. Give it. Oh. Oh? <laughs> oh? That's all? You're in trouble. Really in it. Right now. In it and surrounded by it. We've got monsters. Big fans of ours. These two and way more. <gasps> so, we asked nicely. But you had to make us mad. Now, we'll do this our way. I feel like I just lost more IQ points from that seed. I saw a bonfire. That's gotta be her. What were those strange sounds? Tamara and her friends singing. You, you call that singing? You're a generous man, Fogato. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Don't worry about it. People call them the racket of Solm for a reason. Weird that they stopped. An attack, you think? Let's get over there and find out. Tamara! Oh! Hey, Fagato! So you're Princess Tamara. Nice to meet you. Don't tell me. You're the Divine Dragon, right? We've skipped past everyone believes me as soon as I tell them I'm Divine Dragon straight to everyone just assumes I'm the Divine Dragon. Fogato wouldn't have come here unless he found you first. He wouldn't have... what? Uh, not important. We've got bigger stakes to roast. Have to deal with these bandits for a start. Hmm, that was an interesting line just then. It'd really help if you could use your summoning powers on this ring. The Ring of the Radiant Hero. I've always wanted to meet the person who lives in here. Can you make that happen? All right. I'll find Great. And a one and a two. I'll finally get to remember his name. Fight on. Emblem of Radiance. Yep, that's him. Those arms! You're ready to fight! I'm Ike. Make sure you use me wisely. Ike. That- none of the names that were coming into my mind were Ike. There was no way I was going to remember his name. Thanks for your help, Ike. You'll be fighting alongside Princess Tamara in this battle. Also, Tamara seems to like what she saw. I think she was checking you out, dude. Okay, so who's equipped to Ike then? Is it Princess Tamara? Because that sure would be a thing. Alright, well Princess Tamara is not in my list of units. She'll probably become controllable during the fight. Alright, so what are we up against now? Destructible. Junk. Okay. It's like a shanty town or something. Okay, axe, sword, sword, axe, axe, sword, sword, axe, dagger. Not seeing a whole lot of lances here. seeing no lances whatsoever, so I don't think I'm going to have much use for axe fighters in this particular battle. Alright. Useful to know. Now Lapis can use axes or swords, so that doesn't necessarily mean I'm going to leave her behind. But I want sword fighters. Lots and lots of sword fighters. So I've got myself. Lapis. Where's Diamant? There he is. And I could also bring Kagetsu. 
Who would I leave behind? I don't really need to bring Fram. She's almost, I'm pretty sure level 20 is max. So she's almost max level until I class her up. And my support with her is at maximum, so... There we go. Swap her out for Kagetsu. Don't really think I'm going to need Louie here. So who to bring instead? Maybe Etie? Yeah, I think Etie will do. Alright, so I've got a couple of casters. I've got Yunaka, the out-of-control killing machine. And a bunch of sword fighters. And Etie. That seems reasonable. Okay, yep, it's uh, Princess Tamara who's bonded to Ike. So, Sentinel class. She's a Lance user. Interesting. Seriously, Penette, that, that makeup by her mouth, that makes her mouth look wide and stitched shut, that's so horrible. It looks terrible. <laughs> and we have Marin. Oh, Wolf Knight! I finally get a Wolf Knight. That's so cool. Alright. So, how do I want to arrange my troops? We'll be able to blast our way through the junk. Uh, let's just dive in. And our we get we win when we defeat Tetchi and Tochi. Or on the opposite side of the map. We'll try to clear the map, of course. Oh, I just realized this is a dark map. I should give somebody a torch. I have room in my inventory. There we go. And maybe I should give one to somebody I'm going to send southward. Can I go to the store and buy more torches? And I'll give them to Diamant. Three hundred G, we can afford it barely, because I'm pretty much broke. Now we're ready to fight. What's that? More? Those cheap, cheap birds must have gone con for help. Fooey! That's what I say. They won't beat our monsters. That's right. Not to mention our thieves. Experts in the yard of Rance Zachary. <laughs> They're gonna attack the village. We have to stop them before anybody gets hurt. Marin, Pennet, come on! As you command, my princess, <coughs> we'll crush them with the hammer of justice. Indeed, they shall sorely regret terrorizing these poor, innocent people. Convenient. Their uh, change of position, I mean. All right, so... A wolf rider, so cool. Uh, Panet, you're Get on away. visit the village duty. Uh, what's that? Uh, bandits? Oh, jeez. I'd rather you get a hold of this than they do. Ooh, a seraph robe. Hit point plus five, that's what that does. I'm ready. Here goes. Oh yeah, I should probably there we go, get the enemy attack radius. And I'll use my torch. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's a bunch of enemies. Yes. 
Hello, Jolene, my cat has arrived. Thank you, Saline. And Show me the way. Citrine, can you deal the finishing blow? Alright, this guy is a sword user, so I'm going to want to have a... Whoa, cat! No, 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 hold on. Sorry, I have to deal with my cat. Okay, sorry about that. Can't have her jumping all over my computer keyboard. That's a good way to screw up the recording for sure. Okay, what was I doing? Right, if she's going to get attacked first anyway, it's fine if she has the iron blade. Shall I go? There we go. Where to? We'll send Etier with them. And... What you got? Yunaka this way, so the Eastern group is going to be a lot stronger. Now... Okay, so Tamara is a level 18 base class, and Marin's a level 1 promoted class, it looks like. Oh wow, Wolf Rider can use daggers. With pride. That's interesting. my princess all right we're gonna want to clear the way here good grief ah oh, we need to try to get to this village before uh, the enemy does so I guess we're gonna have to make our way southward I, I know game I know the way forward is blocked but not for long go Tamara with my strength, you'll have no problem opening up a path. Ah, increase as he takes damage. Increase defense and resistance as hit point decreases. Fascinating. Laguz, friend. Oh, right, the Laguz were like a race that was discriminated against in the GameCube games or something like that. But reduces a void rate to zero. Fascinating. Great Ether hardens the unit's defenses for one turn, then attacks an area and recovers HP. Sounds like Ike has an interesting ability set. I'm gonna have to try to learn it well. You think the village will loot itself? Get gone! Yeah, start at that house there. Well, there wasn't much I could do to stop that. Let's go! <laughs> this is why I brought torches. Oof. How dare you do that to Citrine, you swine. You're not gonna kill them. Was that too much? 
It was just enough. Maybe I should have destroyed it with Etie. Yeah, I definitely think I should have done that. Might seem like a trivial thing to roll back time for, but... Now, can Kagetsu get up there? He sure can. And dead. Even mighty ones fall. So that enemy has type advantage over Panette here. Need to try to get down here to at least save that house. That seems like there's nothing you can do about the one to the east. At least I sure don't see how you could save that one. Is it just me, or are dagger users insanely strong? Let's do this. So who has that demolish skill? Is that one of Ike's skills? Bring it. Okay, and now let's start bringing the main group to the south. I don't see any reason to try venturing out into the water, and I probably can't anyway. I don't think uh, units can move into the water at will. <laughs> Calm down, Citrine. You'll be fine. Saline's here to heal you up. I can see that. that. Panette scares me a bit. She doesn't strike me as entirely stable. Don't know how necessary it will be for him to use his torch because this area down here is pretty well lit. Though there is obviously some shadow, so yeah, go ahead and use it, Diamant.
And yep, looks like I revealed some more enemies. Alright, so they're trying to flank us. How best to deal with that? Fire would kill it, the Levin Sword wouldn't quite. But I'm okay with that, actually. Okay, never mind. All in the name of peace. Alright, so I think I want to get to the southwest to try to save that building. Go ahead and engage, because the enemies are probably going to come for you after you destroy this. Grant me strength and victory! Which weapon do I want you to use? We're up against swords and an axe. So a sword weapon would be best, and it's the one weapon type you don't have. Whatever, let's just use the silver lance. Between... Uh, Tamara Ike and these three. I think they've got the Southwest covered. Hmm. Maybe you two can start heading this way and clean up these enemies. And... Hmm. The rest of my team, looks like we might want to do a push east so we can clear out all these enemies and get the XP for them. So I think we want to head south. An invitation? Nice. That was cool, was it not? It, it was pretty cool. Okay, that's a lot of enemies. Guys, looks like Tamara needs some help. Ah, there's still another obstacle in the way. Good grief, they have a lot to break through. Alright, they can finally join the fray. Good grief, that's a lot of enemies. I might get some people killed here. So, what is this great ether? Endure to hit area next turn. That looks pretty darn good. It's an AoE attack. Those are very rare in Fire Emblem. Interesting. Alright, I'll try it. I have a feeling that all the enemies are not going to be in that area next turn. So, who can attack you? Lots of enemies, hmm. Maybe I should help block for her with Lapis here.
Alright, hold on. Does that archer have a longbow? Yep, okay. That explains that. Oh, those longbows are a pain. I may take some losses there. I will strike you down. Nice. You were a worthy opponent. Rolled a natural twenty on that one. Those two seem to have it under control over there. On the other hand, the situation to the south still looks kind of tenuous. So reinforcements are on the way. Kill Diamant. Panette's taking a beating. There are more of those enemies than I realized. Uh oh. Panette's down. I didn't realize there were so many of them there. Because of, you know, the darkness. That fog of war, man. Okay. That was pretty effective. That seems like a tough ability to make proper use of because the enemy needs to cooperate and stay around you. So that you catch them the next turn. But it worked out well enough that time. We got, what, three kills off of that? Oh, this does not look good over here. I didn't realize there were that many flyers. Good grief. Saline, you might need to help out over there. Um, maybe I should help out a bit as well. Mm, should I engage? Would give me access to a bow. How tough are these guys? Well, okay, maybe level 21 isn't the max, or level 20 isn't the max, because those guys are level 21. So never mind about that, I guess I was wrong. Hmm. So those guys are pretty tough, but... Are, is there engage energy? There's some here. There's some here. Okay, I can engage. It'll be fine. You and me, Lynn. Lend me your strength. Let's take him down with Astra Storm. Let's use the Mullah gear. Now I have you.
That was some overkill. I just realized Marin has a tail. Is that a real tail or is that like an accessory on your outfit? All right, the situation looks a lot more under control over there. A good fight. All right, I think we've rescued this house. Let's go check in with the residents. I assume that uh, your time is running low on your bond. Hmm. Where does it say how much longer that has? I still haven't figured that out. But anyway, I think you're probably going to want to recharge it soon. Hmm. Some of the enemies look like they want to come this way and some of them this way. Alright, I'll we'll tell you what, you guys go this way. Not sure I want to make a target out of you for that guy. Seriously, dagger users are insane. They'll get there someday. There we go. Sure, go ahead and destroy it. You know, the residents of the town probably don't appreciate us destroying all their stuff like this. And we're rudely just calling it junk. Let's see, actually. Lapis could use a heal, so... I should have maybe refreshed my torch. Rather than just taking no action. That would have been useful. Should I pull another enemy? Maybe this guy up here. Alright, you two come down this way, I suppose. What are you? Oh, he has a pole axe. Okay, it's effective against cavalry.
Victory is mine. Princess. Finally. Oh no! I'll tell my Nana to hide. Use this to beat the bad guys. Ooh, a rescue. Cool. Could be useful. Pulls allies next to the user, adjacent to the user of the staff, as I recall. Let's go ahead and actually renew our torch now. Is that a rare critter? I guess it would make sense for a wolf knight to be a, a creature otaku. Monster otaku, something like that. All right, we've got a dagger user there, so ranged. Could do dagger versus dagger. Let's see. Hold on. Okay, there's no emblem refresh points between here and there, so I should save her engage mode. I can keep going. You can indeed. Oh, nice. That went well. Boy, they apparently have a whole lot of flyers. More than I realized. Destroy him. I won't let this go to my head. Let's see. Okay, I can wreck that guy's face. Sure, Saline, you have nothing else to do this turn, so soften him up, even though it's unnecessary. <laughs> I'm gonna take a kill for myself for once. Until no one can beat me. Okay, so we've got a couple enemy wolf knights. You know, this is a surprisingly long fight, isn't it? We've been at this a while. I'm here. Yunaka's feeling a little less overpowered these days. Need to increase her strength or something. Claim 
this victory. Respectable level. Oh, so Yunaka and Citrine can get support levels. That sounds interesting. Are these guys just endless reinforcements or what? Because the number of these flying corrupted we have fought is a little insane. I kind of need to refresh my, em refresh my emblem energy too. I mean, I don't absolutely have to, but I have a feeling that being able to engage will be pretty useful against these guys. Okay, yeah, you can get in range to attack him. I don't know if that's wise to make you vulnerable like that, but it is something we can do. Hmm. I'll risk it. Saline's not feeling quite so overpowered these days either. Her speed is lagging, so she's not doubling anybody is the problem. Should probably take care of these guys before I worry about refreshing my emblem energy. Man, Marin is just a killing machine. Not attack. Heal up Marin. She's getting kinda hurt. My gratitude. Feels odd to use the very formal sentence structure. That was X. Ooh, I just spotted a rare bug. That was X, was it not? And then to insert the colloquialism, cool. <laughs> you were a worthy opponent. It's kind of incongruous. Good level. Well, you pretty much single-handedly killed everything, Marin. You are incredibly strong. But, you are taking hits, so we'll have... Yeah, you don't have a vulnerate. You have an elixir. But, I think I will let Saline heal you up. I'm gonna have to remember to replace this heal staff. Ha! I can fight again! There we go. Okay, well, there is quite the army converging on boss, the bosses there. Just realized my uh, 
This has gone on so long that my computer was uh, had turned off its screen. I don't think that'll affect the recording. Hopefully not. All right, I think it's time to start pulling the bosses. So you've got a tomahawk. Anything for you. Hmm. I need somebody with range to pull. Which means not you, Lapis. I think maybe it's time for you, Naka, to finally engage. Quick change. Perfect. Charge! Troops, charge! Hit them from all sides. Whoops. Nothing I hate worse than a meddler. You stuck your nose in our business, you'll pay. We shall see. They certainly have hit points. I see. It looks like the way your transformation looks doesn't just depend on the emblem, but also the character that the emblem is bonded to. Fascinating. But yeah, I just realized these guys have a ton of hit points and revival gems, so this is going to be interesting. All right, I reckon it's time for another Astra Storm. Hmm. Oh wow, crit chance is zero percent with the killer bow. Maybe Astra Storm can't crit. Uh, let's see. Which guy? Which guy? Let's weaken him, I guess. The oasis is ours, you hear? We've got exclusive plundering rights. That's not how it works, dude. As if I lose. This is it. Love being able to attack from out of range. I'm in. Whoa. <laughs> hmm, survived with two HP, uh. That's unfortunate. Get in there, Diamant. Here we go. Beat me to the punch. That was a good level, finally. Whew, those revive gems. Ooh, the Parthia. Yeah, let's use that for fun. I'll help. That's one down. Was it much of a big brother? Was I? All right. Now, can we take the other guy down in one turn? I doubt it.
What's he using? An axe? So I would want to use a sword. But we can try. Maybe we can. Here we go. Not done yet. Man, Lucina's ability to just join in chain attacks from really far away. It's easy to underestimate that, but that adds up to a huge amount of extra damage in a fight like this. That's a really good ability. Let's do this. This should do it. Nice. Yes, I let my brother down again. I would agree, Marin was the MVP. Total killing machine. Oh, that was a long one, wasn't it? I didn't think that battle would be quite so long. Next time, we uh, view the cutscene in the aftermath and, you know, all the usual things we do after a story battle. So hopefully you'll join me for that, and I'll see you then.